It's the first time in two years fans are cheering on the Jayhawks together on a holiday with no COVID-19 guidelines. And it's all making a big difference for local businesses. KSHB 41 News reporter Megan Abundance joins us live. Megan, how's it, how's it looking out there? It's pretty loud out here, guys. There is a big crowd for the KU game now that started just about 20 minutes in. And there was a huge crowd at Power and Light. Kind of an exodus right now, but as you can see behind me, the live set just ended and people are starting to make their way out. But bar owners say they are back to what they love doing, and that's entertaining people. But college sports, KU making this tournament run after a Big 12 championship and St. Patrick's Day, they say that is the luck of the Irish. People packed restaurants and bars from South Kansas City to across the river. Tonight we have the KU game for the first round of the tournament. Um, we expected a huge crowd. Big events that have lined up, something that hasn't happened in a while. Right now we're just really, really thankful that it's some semblance of normal and getting back to, you know, what people love, college basketball, St. Patrick's Day, and just being able to go out and have a couple drinks with friends and just have a good time. Because we all recall what it did look like. It was rough. It was, you know, mass, uh, limited capacity, which, you know, put a damper on everybody's pocket. But many Many of the businesses will tell you they're still climbing back to normal. It's not about profits now. It's about, you know, just getting back to what we used to do, you know, time and time again, and just keep going from there. While others are starting their normal, Brady and Fox hit their opening day today. Being an Irish bar and being our first day of business was definitely a challenge to get open today. Their key to success, not being overwhelmed. It's a big day, and I will say that's why we didn't really advertise it out there too much. You might remember the Power and Light District looked a whole lot different two years Years ago, empty, quiet, and restricted. But today, they're expecting a huge crowd and a live performance tonight. Events businesses can get behind. Pure Kansas City spirit, where it's like, you know, we're not down, we're not out yet, and we're just gonna, you know, grit our teeth and go right through it. And it's fun to kind of be back on that up, that uptick, and just be like, all right, here we go. You know, we're ready to ready to do this again. There are still hundreds and hundreds of people out here. And again, it is a big DWI night and police are warning people to not drink and drive. They will be out in full force. Live from Power and Light, I'm Megan Abundis, KSHB 41 News. Indeed, have fun, but be safe and responsible. Megan, thank you.